key to show business, some say, is to always keep them wanting more. By the end of the 2023 Ukulele and Tofino Battle of the Bands final, you can bet the party was just getting started. But it also sort of seemed like everybody wanted to do it all over again. In fact, with the ANAF filled to capacity for both nights of the Battle of the Bands, it only seemed right to figure out a way to bring the party to everyone. So the Pacific Rim Art Society teamed up with YukiTube to produce this video. If you want to start the story from the beginning of the beginning, you can find the preliminary round right here on the Pacific Rim Art Society's YouTube channel, another full video with all eight contenders. This video is going to pick up more or less where that one finished. At the uh, end of the beginning, I guess. Something I've heard some people refer to as the middle. With Bronwyn, the president of the ANAF Hall and the events MC announcing the finalists who will be competing in the video you're about to watch. Bronwyn, take it away! Ready to announce the top three are Charlie Portfolio and the Halibut Cowboys, the Blue Holes, and Good Girl! And so the stage is set. We know which three will battle for more than $1,500 in cash prizes and a chance to play at the Pacific Rim Arts Society's Summer Festival, as well as gaining the adoration of dozens of screaming fans. Each band has its own challenges to face if they dare to hope take the grand prize. We're all disbanding after. She's yeah, going to Mexico. This is a one show <laughs> wonder. So, but the finals are in two weeks. That was great. I'm stoked that we're in the top three. We didn't think about the fact that maybe now we have to prepare like another bunch of songs. Take a day off tomorrow and reconvene and think about it. I hope that I'll have other people on stage with me. For this one, I'll just kind of see how it goes, but I'm very sure of the songs that I want to share. I've been pretty confident in my songwriting for a long time, but it was something that was really private. It's more the live performance piece that's been a huge thing for me to learn just over the past couple years. Knowing that I can go up there and do that by myself in a room, I feel even better if there's other people up there with me. We'll go through the bands in the order that they performed in the finals. Charlie Cornholio and the Halibut Cowboys will be missing two of the members who participated in the preliminary round. And perhaps tougher than that, it's both of their singers. Dakota and Jacob aren't gonna be able to make it. Looks like they have a problem. I'm the problem. Actually, I'm the solution, I would say. Three rehearsals <laughs> with, with the new guys. Yeah, yeah. and they went all right? Oh, so good, <laughs> so good. Is that nervous excitement? Yes. You think you're gonna kill it? Oh yeah. Here are some highlights from their set, but you can check it all out later in the video. This song is about Wiccan in a speech. Nine feet on 11 seconds. <laughs> Well, it looks like the secret weapon and the solution did their job pretty well for Charlie Cornholio and the Halibut Cowboys. I caught up with the blowholes a few days before the finals to see if they had come up with enough material to perform and found out they'd also added another member to the pod. Ooh, 
Is this a secret weapon? Secret weapon. There's nothing to see here. I'm Katie. Grew up playing the piano, Doing so that. here I am. How do you feel about being a blowhole, first of all? You know what? I had a bit of regret voting for such names before I knew I was going to be a blowhole. It's all funny when it's someone else. We're a new band. We're going to let you pick the name. The blowholes? Yeah, we knew that was gonna happen. We're the blowholes. You grew up playing the piano, but have you been done a lot of gigging? Will people have seen you around town or heard you anywhere? This will be. Other than I think of saying say my name in karaoke once. We've been practicing a lot. Starting to get pretty sick of each other. Yeah, we're starting to, the fights are starting to happen. Yeah. So you're a real band now. Exactly. <laughs> it's happening. Rory fell asleep with his guitar the other night. That was rock and roll. Yeah, with my guitar in my hands on my back. Doing any more original songs, or is this going to be mostly a cover set because you're because of the time constraints? We wrote one the other day. We are trying to write another one. So this is really a growth thing. You guys are co co writing and yeah. playing your first ever proper proper, for lack of a better word, gigs. <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling? Are you confident? We're working hard. <laughs> I don't think anyone's working as hard as we are. Charlie Cornholio. One of them isn't going to be in Mexico. The rules around band member changes are interesting. Mm -hmm. like, we were wondering that too, and they're like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> so we can be an entirely different band. Yeah, we, yeah. Get every, we should get everyone. We should well, did they manage to get the material together? Is Kate ready to rock? Does Luke think that they're going to start the set with a bass solo? Stay tuned to find out. Just like the last one, here's a little highlight reel from their set, but you can watch the whole thing later in the video. Well, that's two down, and it seemed they managed to rise to the challenges they faced. Good Girl has a different challenge, though. She knows her material. Remember, she performed solo the first night and seemed to be looking for a secret weapon of her own. She also chose to perform last after the two larger bands. Does she have something up her sleeve? Did you find a bass player or something? Did I what? No, Did I didn't find anyone. I'm up next. So. Yeah, so you're hoping to shift the groove a little bit, shift the vibe I'm hoping a little bit. Check out Good Girl's whole set later in the video. That's what we want to hear. Okay, this one is No One's Anything. No, you think that you'll never tell you. Woo! How's everyone doing?
Thanks, everyone. If your name is Michael, this is for you. If your name is not Michael, you can also listen to the song. Um, but yeah, here it goes. And with that, all of the performances are complete. The judges, in a ritual older than time, sequester themselves away in a dark, dank chamber to decide the fate of the competitors. Who will win the $1,000 grand prize? Everybody's gonna walk away from this a winner, that's for sure. Some of them are just bigger winners than others. As far as you're concerned, all these people can play at the summer festival in the summer. Yeah, they just need to be at different places. It should be no sweat. If, if they can put festival. that together in a couple of weeks, like they all changed all things all over the place and wrote songs and stuff. So I, I just can't, they'll be amazing in a month or two. If they stay together. I'm really happily surprised. And honestly, some of the songwriting. Some of those original tracks, just, I thought were really beautifully written. Yeah. Lyrics, audience engagement, costumes, some of the covers, making it their own. I actually feel quite inspired by what I saw tonight. This is wonderful. Mm -hmm. The talent here, I'm blown away. The reporter here with all of these notes and, uh, and you know, like a whole article, and I just got like a few numbers. So it, like, I have an emotional response to the whole. I, I have them all one point apart. All of these people deserve to play at any festival they want. They're all welcome to play on the radio. My answers. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Do you have insurance? Ah, do you have insurance? I can't walk. I can't play the piano. Ah. She wrote all you her know, songs. She wrote all her songs. Yeah, their last original so, songs. So or I might, I might switch my, my. Like I don't care about the numbers. I like, I don't know. What do you guys think? Those tie dye. She's all what the muscles the were muscle? too much. Trust me, I had to move through the muscles in my body too. My technical, and they're just by one point. Be the end. I know those guys, and they're full of muscles, and that confuses me, and I like it. Is that your first as well? Uh, well, I said I have them basically tied. Bobby, Is this where we throw ice at each other, and I yeah, yeah. we're not you with a chair no! and stuff? <laughs> Original music is important because that's something proud is yeah. to do, is creation of the yeah. art. No, Seems... but you got you can't feel bullied. Like you gotta no, be... no, 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 I'm on board with that. Okay. Okay. And did yes. you just say blow holes for blow holes? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes? That's my vote. Yes? Okay. Oh, no. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. I think we should Come go. Me go. <laughs> yeah, okay. So we are uh, confirmed. Everyone deserves an accolade. There's only one of and they're written down right there. We're gonna have to slip out the back door. Do you think door. we should go out and have yeah. Well, no, that's the whole point, is you get to hand these results to Bronwyn and disappear. <laughs> she announces them, you're gone. So the judges slink away into the night, and Bronwyn prepares to deliver their verdict.
with shirts. two amazing bands, crushed between them with love. Please welcome to the stage, Laura Van Wilkenberg. And with that, there are prizes, high fives, and hugs. But there was even more than that. We've all already won, honestly. And I know that's like the cheesy answer, but it's just the truth. Like the music that night was so good. And I get to have another piece of that and then get to see the other acts as well. Like that's just a great night. So I don't know what else more I could want. The more I have opportunities to share music, the more I want to. And that concludes the ballad of the 2023 Pacific Rim Art Society's Battle of the Bands. But the song will get another chorus because Praz, the NAF, and everyone else involved are already thinking about trying it again next year. So I'd start practicing now. So thanks once more to the Pacific Rim Arts Society, the ANAF, Heritage Canada, the volunteers, Kelly, the executive director at Praz that did a lot of the legwork for this, of course the audiences, the musicians, and everybody else who made this possible. The video you've been watching was made by me, Jeff, for YukiTube slash Praz, with the help of Jeremy Siren on an extra camera for some of the performances and the judging and whatnot. This theme song you've been hearing every once in a while is called Coffee and Crayons by Lothar Mick. Of course, the judges got to thank those guys, Cam, Miles, and Nora. They wanted to make it absolutely sure that you knew that they loved you all. And I uh, think every one of the musicians was great. Please don't send them hate mail if you don't agree with the outcome of the votes. Uh, the rest of this video is going to be the full performances, so you can get a closer look at how everybody played. Uh, my desperate attempts at cinematography is a very small crew in a dark room playing with cameras. And otherwise, uh, check out more West Coast content via me, if you like, uh, on the YukiTube channel right here. Stick around, enjoy the rest of the show, and we'll see you next year for the next Battle of the Bands 2024, y'all!
songs about Wiccan in his speech. Nine feet out of eleven seconds. <laughs> I hope that I'll be shaded by the tree 
by a meadow of green for about a mile. I'm headed into town, 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 and inside. With all my favorite colors. Second vowel noise is ah. 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 So we're going to do those. You can follow me. Um, it'll all become clear soon enough.
This one's called Get yeah, Out. No. Wait, no, is it? No. It's called Going Somewhere. We hope you like it. of your stare, I ain't got a destination, but we're going somewhere.
his prosperity Who runs into the shade To cut through red tape Hey, fingernails And fish oh. are like justice And a voice is dark Like tinted glass She's hurt and thorough And sharp as a tack She's tearing a facility And picking out slack I want a girl with a short
introducing you to the band. Over here on the bass, we have Mud. Back there on the drums is Joel. This is Katie on the keys. We're the Bulls.
we've got one more for you. It's our last song for the Bullhose.
anything. And the last one I just played is called Sunflower. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take a break from the ukulele and I'm gonna pick up my guitar.
Yeah.